bust down, Barbiana, bust down, Barbiana. So I just finished packing up. And I got a stain on my shirt. Either way, this is the outfit I'm wearing. I am on my way to Miami for a carnival. Let me get out of here. It's pretty loud. And I have packed everything. I am driving. This is everything I am bringing. Um, yeah. Makeup and accessories, shoes in the back, and clothes here. Yeah, I know it's a lot, but it's what I'm bringing. Oh, a smoothie. I'm about to say bye to my best friend. Hello. Sorry. I'm about to leave. Normally I just eat on the road, but because I'm on a diet, I'm gonna make breakfast now. Some eggs, some oatmeal, probably a um, probably a um, yeah, that's it. <laughs> um, just kind of double check, and I have everything, but I'm pretty much good. So I'm just make some breakfast. So it is a bit dark. Um, I just got here. Got here at eleven o'clock. I'm still in my car. I'm waiting for my friend to show up because I am staying at her house for Carnival weekend. And I'm hungry. I stink. I'm ready to take a shower. So yeah, that's uh, another thing. But I will be back tomorrow morning when I wake up. <laughs> everything <laughs> let's get that out the way um this is day two of carnival weekend um i could not vlog yesterday i drove from atlanta to miami um the drive is nothing to me it's about a nine hour drive and i got here i left tuesday morning tuesday at 12 and um got here 11 at night and wednesday i was just exhausted and my friend had to do a lot of shopping so i was just kind of following her around at the mall getting her things that she needed to get prepared for me personally um i didn't really buy shit um for carnival i just am going to recycle a lot of my old outfits um being the fact that i'm trying to make sure my my purse is, is sit tight um yeah so not really spending much money on carnival um, I am about to, I'm mad dizzy and tired. I'm about to go to Wawa, probably Dunkin' Donuts. Um, Wawa is a gas station, get me some water and ice. And probably stop at Dunkin' for coffee because literally I am dizzy as fuck. I really don't, I like, we went to a party last night insert clip <laughs> and um i when i said i was liquor when i said i was drunk i had no business being that drunk already but it was a good kickoff like it was a good kickoff i mean like i had a lot of fun like and i had my haitian flag out like baby because i'm always gonna carry my haitian flag where is it it's back there it's it's back there all the all the cards i'm always carrying my haitian flag baby always um yeah so that's what i'm about to go do i'm so thirsty let me give you some water okay so i am getting ready to go to it <laughs> Okay, so we're getting ready to go onto a boat ride. I have a few options. I'm also very hungover. This. 
My favorite fat girl bathing suit. I'm just, I just love this bathing suit so much, and I really want to wear this one. Um, I got a few bottoms. I'm definitely gonna try this on first because it will definitely give me a lot of support. We'll see what you're gonna wear, and I'm, I'm, then I wanna, whatever I wear, I'm wearing a hat over my braids because <clears throat> it's gonna get hot easy. So, yeah. Okay, so I decided to go with this bathing suit top and went with black cover-up bottoms. I'm gonna wear a pink hat. Pink hat. Because I just I just know me and I get migraines so bad I need to wear a hat. And I'm about to put some sunscreen on my legs. Um just so just because I'm about to put these pants on and miles a bit over the way. So not only am I tired and sleepy, I have been sitting in his car for about three hours, which is fine because I'd rather not be in there. But the band that we are playing with, my friend that I'm playing with, her costume, for some odd reason, uh, look at the black out of my eyes. For, from the mascara for some odd reason and i still have my bathing suit on from earlier y'all like from the boat party we came straight here don't even let me get started on the boat party but for some odd reason her costume is not ready like they are making the motherfuckers right now one by one and they're so the way it works is that pickup time is when you come and pick up your costume so their pickup time is from six to eight. It is now eleven nineteen. They told them it'll take an hour. We've been here since seven thirty four, and it's eleven nineteen. The hour came and went a long time ago. Um, <clears throat> I'm just too exhausted and tired, and as you guys can see, like I am so like after effects from being drunk all day. I did not want to go inside. I'm too tired. I don't care. Um, my I did miss my time to come get my costume today. And the reason I missed my time was because the boat. Um, the boat ride that we went on, um, ironically, today was the same time. I'm so fucked up. Okay, let me say that again. So... My time to pick up my costume was from 2 to 6. The boat was supposed to dock at 4. That would have given me enough time to come and get my costume. But for some reason, the boat took off late. On top of the boat taking off late, the boat did not dock until 6 o'clock. And then they told me that they were not going to be distributing any more costumes after 6 and have to come tomorrow. So basically, I had to come all the way back to Fort Lauderdale tomorrow because I'm in Miami currently at my friend's house and I had to come tomorrow morning. So at least they're not gonna have to make my costume. And not only do I have to come back tomorrow to get my costume, they sent us an email basically saying that a piece of my costume won't be ready because due to the hurricane, they, they can't, they don't have the piece. Like, that's basically what they said. So they're going to be exchanging out a piece for something else. But it's like, the piece that they're trying to give me, I don't want. Like, if I wanted that piece for my costume, I would have bought it. So it's just a little frustrating. I'm going to see how I get me, since for them to give me a different type of piece. Because I really don't like the piece that they're trying to give me for my costume. Um... Yeah, because basically they're saying, so my costume is kind of, it's, it's very plain, but I love that it's plain and, and like, like beautiful and this simple. 
and it comes with these sleeves these mesh sleeves with a little bit of um uh feathers at the end of the sleeves and the sleeves go basically from here to like basically to my um wrist and then the feathers are at the wrist so pretty and there's jewels on the mesh and basically they don't have it which is very sad um so i've been sitting in the car just waiting for them to come like, they've come in the car and check up on me and we've talked and my friend smoked and my cousin came come to find out my cousin is in the same band as my home girl so yeah yeah so yeah uh, but the boat ride was so litty. I'm not gonna flex. Like, even though it started, wow, my car did me so dirty for doing that. Wow, thanks. Even though so many interruptions, even though um, I'm exhausted, the boat ride was very litty. Um, it did start, it did dock late, but once we got on that bitch, it was a vibe. Um, I took me some nausea pills because I do get seasick very easy. I get nauseous very easy and dizzy. And I was fine on the boat. I got really, really drunk. Um, yeah. Well, I'm going to tell you something, y'all. When it comes to Miami Carnival, as a woman, if you're single, let me tell you. There is every piece of man you can think of that you could have. You want a nigga from Trinidad, he's here. You want a nigga from Guyana, he's here. You want a nigga from Canada, they're here. You want a nigga from England, they're here. Nigeria, Jamaica, listen, there's so many flavors. You can have anything you want. I also ran out of storage. <laughs> and I forgot what I was talking about. Either way, y'all. There is so many different type of men out here. There is no way that if you're single and and you're looking, that you're not gonna find somebody, somebody, son, to take down. Um, but yeah, um, that's it for me. Like the party was really lit. Um, I had a good time. Um, but I'm just not going in there. Tomorrow, I'll be picking up my costume and I will take you guys with me through the whole process. I'm just going to have to delete a whole bunch of stuff today to make space for everything that I record tomorrow. So, yeah. So, I am here getting my costume, y'all. You guys can see it's kind of busy on all sides, but I'm moving. The line moving. I was here all last night, but I'm back. <laughs> the line is moving. Look at her cute little top. It's so cute. Good morning, y'all. It is 
5.40 in the morning. This is day three of carnival. As you can tell, <laughs> I'm exhausted. Um, but I'm having fun. Um, we about to Juve in a little bit. I'm getting dressed right now. Um, if you don't know what Juve is, it's like a paint party. Um, everything is going to get dirty. Everything you will have to throw away. And, yeah. Um, I thought I... <laughs> I brung the wrong, I'm so tired. I came with the wrong outfit for Juve. Somehow I grabbed the wrong thing and I really don't have anything to wear that I'm okay with throwing away. So I'm gonna have to sacrifice something in this suitcase that I don't mind having paint on. And then my shoes is another problem because Somehow, I didn't think about the fact that my shoes are going to get dirty. And I don't want to use the shoes that I'm wearing for carnival. Yeah. Um, this is my Juve shirt. I just cut it up and put a little slit in here. I might cut it up some more, but we'll see. Um, I'm about to tie my hair up soon because I'm going to put it up. I'm gonna put it in a low ponytail, or I might just do a regular ponytail, only because I'm gonna be putting a shower cap and then I'm gonna be tying it up. So that's why I'm thinking a low ponytail instead of a high one. Yeah, let me go ahead and get dressed because I like early because I don't really know what I'm wearing at all. I'm gonna just show you guys what I got. Um, I got two duffel bags from Mama J uh, for the altitude mask section. Um, um, it came with this, like a little goodie. This is body oil, um, some wipes, some gum, uh, some stickers, hand sanitizer wipes. It also has this. Now this is for Juve. It has. Has my ticket for today, my wristbands, uh, a water bottle, but I'm missing a wristband. What's up, three? Yeah, three wristbands that I'm gonna put on this in the water bottle. So I'm bringing this to Juve because I don't have anything that I'm okay with getting dirty. So I'm gonna just, yeah, throw that in there. other stuff in there too um this is what i'm wearing to juve so i'm gonna be doing these black swimsuit bottoms this see-through this old walmart sports bra and the roma j juve shirt that is it. I'm going to show you guys the other bag, and that is with my costume. Hey guys, we pulled up for breakfast to grab something at this bakery. Never been here, but it's really nice. For this to be open 24 hours, it is so gorgeous. So you about to get breakfast? Oh my gosh. I left. I... No, it's stuck. <laughs> it's falling. <laughs> I have everything I need right here. We stopped to get some breakfast from the Spanish spot because 
Spanish food is just so fucking bomb. We're gonna go to IHOP, but my homegirl told me about. Mm, talk to me when I'm open. My homegirl told me about this place. The Spanish spot is really good. It's open 24 hours. And when I tell you, I haven't had one of these in so long. It's called a Papa Elena. A Papa Elena. Mmm. It's so good. We're kind of rushing because it's um what time it is? I think it's eight o'clock. Um, our section we're supposed to be there at nine. I don't know what this is, but that shit good too. Like literally last night, I don't know what I was doing. <laughs> Not oh, I was so tired yesterday. Not only did I mix, cause I had to get my costume yesterday. Not only did I mix rum. No, no. First of all, I hate rum. Let's get that out of the way. Rum is the worst. Um, but I was drinking Hennessy with my cousin in the beginning because I didn't get a pregame with my homegirl because she's a little farther than my cousin was at her Airbnb. So I pregame with my cousin and she loves Hennessy. So that's what I was drinking. And then took Patron shots at the party. And then my cousin was like, you want this? You want this? I'm drinking it. And I'm like, ew, what is this? She like rum. I'm a, I told you I don't like rum. And when I tell you that shit fucked my stomach up, I wanted to throw up. It was so disgusting. And I just could not eat last night. Like the, the last time I ate yesterday was four o'clock. And I did not eat all day for the rest of the day because my after I drank that rum, I was done. I didn't want to eat. My stomach was hurting. I had to, you know. But I'm fucking this up. That's why I'm like. I know I'm eating y'all face, but I'm so hungry. My friend went into Walmart. If you guys can see, this is Walmart right here. She she ran into Walmart to get some tights for her outfit. So I'm excited for Juve. I'm not excited for the paint. I really don't like getting myself dirty, but I have a, a shower cap under this. I won't be able to really film. I do it because of all the paint. I really don't want to get paint on my phone because I don't have anything waterproof. If y'all don't do nothing, get y'all a papa, papa rilla, papa illa. There you go, come on. Take it, check it. Yes, because we pop champagne for Juve. <laughs> <laughs> Today is the day of carnival. I am getting ready to go to Walmart because I need to get some more wipes for when I get on the road because porta potties, ill, no toilet paper. So um, I'm gonna show you kind of what came in my in my package. I played with Rama J Moss. This is the guy that has your costume. In. So I'm gonna put this is the pieces for my costume. So my leg pieces. My tiara, everything. Um, they also gave me a bottle of Moet. And you guys are going to see it's because they messed up with my costume. And just an update, they said that they don't have any more feathers to give me. So I had to deal with my costume just like this. And I'm not too happy about it, but it is what it is. And... But they are giving me a partial refund because of the issue of my sleeves. And this is the costume. I will be trying on my costume 
right now before I go to Walmart and start doing my makeup. Oh, oh, I have to be careful. One of my gems fell out. Luckily, I brought super glue, not super glue, but um, hot glue. And give me a minute here. The section that I am playing, the section that I'm playing is called Titania. Um, the picture, I'm going to show a picture of the outfit. Again, I thought this costume was going to be completely white. And then with the jewels, kind of find out that it's actually a blue bottom side. Um, and it would have been so beautiful with the, the sleeves that had the feathers, but it's not here, so I can't do anything about it. So I'm going to try it on and see if it fits me because I have not tried this on at all and I'm scared. <laughs> So my costume kind of is the costume from hell these tassels they're not doing me no justice they're they rip through my tights um i would never get a costume again it has these things they rip through my tights really bad sorry i'm recording for youtube oh, you're so fine. it's raining right now you guys so you were saying even though it rains people are still gonna be walking yes. no matter what yes. so rain or shine yes. your ass is walking yes. and shaking ass yes. so because what time is it right now? 141. So the parade is starting at 11. You might have somebody that's getting ready to cross the stage probably at like. So it's people out here fucked up turning up right now. Oh. No, must be this green light. Sorry. You waste for impact. Because I knew it was going. <laughs> oh, true. more roosters. No, those are ducks. I was waiting. I, I was waiting for it. <laughs> So I just finished my last party, SS Fat, and that is the end of Carnival Weekend. I still have paint on me. My mom's not gonna be too happy. This is my cousin Pat. We are blued out. At this point, blued out. You look so freaking blue. <laughs>